How to apply date range filters in Fresh Service Analytics The date range dimension filter is applied to manage the timeframe of the metrics used to create a report. The date range dimension filters comprise date range attributes suitable for the metrics applied in the report. To better understand how the date range dimension filter works, let's create a widget to show the total tickets created for this month. A widget to show the total resolved tickets for this month. Let's get started. Navigate to the reporting icon and hover over it. Choose Analytics. Click on the New Report button to create a new report and name it. Simply drag and drop a chart to create a new widget. Give the widget a name. Click on the Metrics icon and choose a metric from the dropdown. Let's consider the metric tickets here. You can see that the date range dimension filter is automatically added to the metric with the date range attribute as created date. Apply the date range for the attribute created date as this month. Now this metric provides the total number of tickets created this month. Now, let's add another metric to the widget to calculate the total resolved tickets this month. Click on the metrics icon and choose a metric from the dropdown. Let's say the metric is resolved tickets. You can see that a date range dimension is automatically applied. Click inside the filter to edit the date range attribute. Replace the date range attribute, create a date with resolved date. Apply the date range for the attribute resolved date as this month. Click Apply. Now, the metric provides the total tickets resolved this month. If you wish to modify the report filters, navigate to the funnel-shaped icon called Filters. Click on Report Filters, modify the date range as you wish, and click Apply. And that's how you add date range filters in Fresh Service Analytics. If you need further assistance, please reach out to support at freshservice.com.